I found my way down to my favorite kitchen in town, which is Spoons at the Colombo Hilton. And I'm here today with uh, Chef Rohan Fernando Pulli, uh, the executive chef at Hilton, and Chef Lakshman. So, Chef, uh, what do we have here? If you want to have uh, a dinner table, mm -hmm. uh, you've got to have a couple of uh, appetizers, salads, mm -hmm. then you've got to have some main courses. Okay. We are going to do marinated feta cheese. Mm -hmm with uh, Mediterranean type of grilled vegetable. Ooh. Uh, first step is to marinate the feta cheese. Okay. Now for that, the ingredients, feta cheese, I have olive oil, uh, rosemary. This is yeah. rosemary. We will marinate and then go on to the next step. Right. right? This is feta cheese cu cut into cubes, yeah. right? So we put the feta cheese here, right? Uh, olive oil. Uh, the chopped up rosemary, rosemary, right? Rosemary, if you see, it gives a nice aroma Lovely and smell. it goes uh, very well with feta cheese, right? Okay. Now, somebody can ask why I don't add salt into this. Okay. Why? Why? Because uh, the feta cheese is quite salty. Okay. So that's why I did not add any salt. There's right? enough salt but in there. But you can add a little bit of Pepper. Uh, pepper, crushed black pepper. Yeah. Right. Like this, if you put it in a bottle, yeah, you can keep it uh, in the refrigerator for a month. Wow. No problem okay. at all. Okay. Right. Then we come to our vegetables. Yeah. Right. So talking about the vegetables, as I told you, Mediterranean type of vegetables. Yeah. So you get green zucchini, yeah. yellow zucchini. I have some uh, abalone. mushrooms, yeah. abalone mushrooms cut into you know this shape uh, long triangle red bell pepper green yeah. bell pepper and onion okay right so there again the first step is to marinate mm -hmm. very simple salt yeah right just on top some salt okay then crushed black pepper mm -hmm. right and olive oil okay now mm -hmm. these vegetables this has, you have to grill it. Okay. Grill means you don't have to use a barbecue grill or whatever. You yeah. can use a griddle plate yeah. or a pan, okay. right? So I have these vegetables, what we have already marinated and okay. grilled. Right. That's why you see, you know, the black marks here. Yeah. But when you're cooking also remember, don't overcook, mm -hmm. right? You have to still have that crunchiness. Crunchiness. Right. Now, we marinate the vegetables mm -hmm. not only with salt and pepper it's already marinated with salt and pepper this is balsamic vinegar mm -hmm. right then i have some dijon mustard mm -hmm. uh, bees honey mm -hmm. and pesto okay somebody could ask what is pesto right nowadays it's readily available at the supermarkets, supermarkets yeah. you can buy mm -hmm. otherwise you can make your pesto and just in case people are wondering what is in pesto the ba uh, main ingredient is basil I have some basil sprigs here, right? right? Uh, a basil, a quite pungent uh, yeah. a, a leaf, right? A basil, uh, parmesan, mm -hmm. uh, pine nuts, okay. uh, rock salt, right? right? Okay. Then you grind it into a paste. This yes. is these are the main ingredients, right? Yeah. So we'll we'll see how we marinate a little bit of uh, you know uh, pesto, not little, as you see, yeah. you know, a fair amount, fair amount. Fair amount then uh, the mustard yeah not very much right uh, balsamic vinegar no balsamic vinegar also actually is quite yes, readily quite, uh, yeah, available yeah, available and also it has a very nice mm. sweet and sour yeah it taste. has a very unique taste unique i taste. love that right and finally mm. uh bees honey, bees honey. We are going to put the whole thing, and right? Everything in a nice bowl. A bowl, and then just toss it up. Right. All right. Just keep in mind, uh, don't overcook the vegetables. You need to have right. a little bit of white in there, yeah. and that's looking beautiful. Yes. So this is, you know, marinated vegetables. Now this, after you marinate, mm -hmm. this can go into a refrigerator, okay. and th you can hold it for a about a day or two. Okay. Just uh, marinated vegetables in a bowl mm. like that yeah. doesn't look very attractive. Right? 
And here today what we are going to do, mm -hmm. rather than just putting it in a bowl, yeah. we are going to present it in a different way. We are going to do individual salads. People can just pick it. Oh, right. right. Okay. You know, there are portions rather than digging into a bowl. Oh, right. Right? Lovely. We prefer to arrange individually. Okay. Like the zucchini, the, the bell peppers, right. the onions. Right? So the rather little, little colors are going to yeah, be nicely. Nicely done. So when you are doing individual portions, mm -hmm. actually you can do it and it look, it'll look beautiful yeah. and appetizing as well. Especially when you have like many on a yes. on table or Just something. Just imagine yeah. like New Year, yeah. we do these type of things in hundreds, <laughs> right, on a buffet. So <laughs> Quite a bit of work actually. <laughs> work? Yeah. Chef Lakshman's very neatly arranging this. Just um, like uh, Chef Rohan said, um, it's not going to be messy, you're not going to be digging your spoon in and you know dolloping it onto your plate. You just take your individual portions and it's going to look very nice and very presentable. Here we have a marinated... Uh, yes, I uh, almost forgot about that. Uh, marinated feta, yeah. right? Not too many, right? Uh, we are going to use some olives, okay. black olives green olives. Okay. As I told you earlier, these are basil, basil. Uh, sprigs, right. right? Tender leaves. So, uh, we have cut the olives into two, yeah. right? So, again, those are seedless olives. Yes, seedless olives, right. So, these olives are also marinated. Mm. Yeah. Nice. Right? So, well, that's pretty much, yeah, yeah. lovely. Beautiful. Grilled Mediterranean vegetable salad with marinated feta cheese. 100 grams feta cheese, one teaspoon rosemary chopped, two tablespoons of olive oil. For the grilled vegetable, the ingredients are 50 grams of red bell pepper cut in long strips, 50 grams of green bell pepper, 50 grams of yellow zucchini, 50 grams of green zucchini, 25 grams of abalone mushroom cut into long strips, 50 grams of eggplant, and 30 grams of onions cut into wedges. Marination for grilled vegetables. Two tablespoons of olive oil, one fourth teaspoon of Dijon mustard, one teaspoon of balsamic vinegar, one teaspoon of bees honey, one tablespoon of pesto sauce, and salt and pepper to taste. Garnish this with basil leaves, green olives, and black olives.